I'm James Beard, I'm Valpax Recycling Services Manager, so I head up Valpax Recycling Arm. On Saturday I'm travelling to Henderson Island. It's the most polluted island on the planet, despite being about 3,000 miles away from any major landmass. Travelling out is a bit of a long journey. It's uh, several flights, so we're flying to LA and then from LA onto Tahiti from Tahiti onto the Gambia Islands and it's at the Gambia Islands that we connect with the vessel and then from there it's about two and a half days by boat out to Henderson Island. Valpac was approached by the organisers of the project which is Pew Charitable Trusts and they originally asked us for some help with regards to the recycling of the plastic that's being collected and the conversation followed that actually Valpac would quite like to support this project on a, on a bigger scale. It's um, mostly fishing nets and, and land-based pollution which flows into the oceans. It gets caught in oceanic currents and Henderson Island's in the unfortunate position on one of these currents whereby it receives a lot of this plastic being washed up upon its shores. Mostly it's going to be collecting plastic from the East Beach, which is the worst affected of the, of the two main beaches on the island. But it's not so simple as just picking up plastic. We'll also be logging every single bit of plastic that we collect. So we'll be trying to ascertain where is where has it come from and what was the original source before it started to break down. So it's going to be a lot of hard work and a lot of manual labour. The remoteness of the island causes a lot of problems with regards to recycling the plastic. So our current aspiration is to take the collected plastic, take it back to Pitcairn Island, which is one of the inhabited islands neighbouring Henderson Island, process it in a rudimentary sense to chip it down, mix it with some lime to kill off any, any living creatures that may still be on that plastic because it presents a biosecurity hazard to other countries. And we're hoping to actually ship it onto Costa Rica where it will be used to make um, roofing tiles for a social housing project.